So we're gonna make an egg curry, as you can see. We've got coconut in there, we've got some garlic, ginger, we've got some lovely spices, and we've got some green peas in there. Absolutely delicious. Welcome back to How To Cook Greek. Okay, so here we've got 400 ml of coconut milk, two cups of garden peas, they're like a frozen pea, I just rushed them through some water there, you know, a little bit of cold water. One cup of onion cut nice and small. Boiled eggs, I've got six there, hard boiled eggs. One teaspoon of cumin seeds, a tiny amount of bell pepper, like a tablespoon or so. A tablespoon there of ginger garlic paste, and then a teaspoon each of chili, coriander, and turmeric. Let's get moving. So you're gonna need a frying pan or a skillet or a little woki type thing like this. In there, I've got three tablespoons of oil. I'm using a sunflower oil, but you can use a different oil if you want. And we're gonna drop into that the one teaspoon of cumin seeds. Now, if you wanted, you could be adding some other whole seeds like fennel seeds, cinnamon, cardamom, green or black, that's up to you. I'm just gonna just do it with these today. And to that, we're gonna add one cup of onion, which I've cut really small using white onion today. And I'm gonna add some salt. So you can hear and see that we're on an above medium heat, a fairly high heat, and we're gonna go for three to four minutes. This is really quick and really easy. Next up, tablespoon ginger garlic paste. Garlic ginger paste is a 50-50 mix of the two. You can buy it in stores if you live near an Indian or Asian type store. Or, like us, you can make it yourself. We use lots of it, so we make plenty of it ourselves. We're gonna drop in now those peas. That little tiny bit of bell pepper. Then we're gonna add our powders. Let's just take another look. So a teaspoon each. Turmeric, chili, coriander, in it goes. Stay on this vibrant heat and keep it going for about another three minutes. Stirring pretty much all the time now. We don't want our powders to burn. If they burn, they taste bitter. Then we're gonna add 400 ml of coconut milk. And we're gonna drop in the hard boiled eggs. I've got six here. Now we're gonna lower the heat to a simmer. Nice low heat. And we're gonna let this go for about another five or six minutes. Job done, beautiful. Okay, so we're done, apart from one more thing. So off goes the heat. First of all, check that for salt, salt level. Now I'm gonna add now some fresh curry leaves. Now you may have seen me cook with these at the beginning, put them in the oil, which you can do, but I like them just in the end on this one. If you can't get fresh curry leaves, which a lot of you can't, judging by your comments, you could put some cilantro or coriander in there. Beautiful, let me get that served. And that's it, a really simple, beautiful, creamy, green peas and egg coconut curry. I hope you enjoy that. Please do take time to leave me a comment, give me a thumbs up, and subscribe to the channel. I'll see you soon. Lots of love.